Hey Android fans, this is Eric with another Android app review. Today I'm going to be talking to you about the app Fox Fi. Before I get to that, I want to remind you that this review is being sponsored by Andy Tags. So uh, go over to andytags.com and check out the really cool NFC stickers and tags uh, for use with your NFC enabled Android or other smartphone. Uh, so today the app I'm going to be reviewing is called Fox Fi. It may be the simplest app I've ever reviewed. There's not a whole lot to it, not a whole lot you need to do to it. Um, but it's amazingly awesome in what it does. If you were to ask people what the number one reason they root their phones, for those of you who even know what that is, kind of like jailbreaking, um, but not really, but kind of, but if you don't know, that's the best way I can explain it. Uh, Probably half of them would say to be able to uh, wirelessly tether their phone to their to a computer or a tablet or something for free without paying for it. Now with these new plans that are coming out, these new shared data plans, it's a mute point because uh, you get free tethering with those plans. Because frankly, Verizon doesn't care if you tether your phone to your tablet if you're paying for that data. And if you go over your data, you're going to pay them even more. So it's free with those plans. But for, you know, thousands, if not millions of us that are still on other plans uh, that either uh, don't have free tethering or, like my plan, I have free unlimited data, but it does not include tethering, a lot of people root their phones just for tethering. Now, there are a lot of other great reasons to root your phone. I'm not talking about that in this review. Uh, I'm just making the point that a lot of people do it simply for using tethering. Why is Foxfy so great? Foxfy is the first app that I know of, free app that allows you to tether your phone without root. So if you have a, a data plan, especially an unlimited data plan, that does not include uh, free tethering, then you can install the app Foxfy on your Android phone and uh, you can uh, launch it and then you can tether your laptop or uh, tablet or other device uh, to your uh, phone, which is especially great if you have 4G and especially especially great if you have 4G unlimited data uh, Which some of us do have so anyway, uh, let's talk about my phone real quick uh, I'm gonna use my phone and my tablet to show you how it works and show you that it works Like I said not too much to show you in terms of settings because basically you just turn it on and use it But uh, we'll hop on my phone and uh, I'll show you show you how it works Okay, so here you see a little Fox Fi symbol right there. So I'm going to open that up. And uh, here you see basically you have activate the Wi Fi hotspot, the network name, password. You can set a password if you want to set a password to uh, connect to your Wi Fi connection. Um, activate Bluetooth DUN. And uh, that is if you want, uh, if you want to share your your 4G connection through Bluetooth instead of through Wi-Fi, um, which you can also do. And uh, hash code, which it says do not change. Um, so I'm going to hit the menu button just so you can see. Basically, uh, help or install an add-on. There's an add-on in the market you can add on so that you can mess with a few settings on here. But uh, I'm not going to talk about those today. Because I just want to talk about this basic app and how awesome it is. So I'm going to activate the Wi-Fi hotspot. So it says starting Wi-Fi hotspot. And it's active. And you can see the little indication up there that it's active. If you do a drop down, you'll see uh, right there. Fox Fi Wi-Fi hotspot ready. So I'm going to set my phone down, come over here to my tablet, in case anyone wants to know, this is the Galaxy Note 10.1, it was my birthday present, um, and I'm still learning a lot about it, but so far, I'm loving it. Uh, so I'm going to hit the settings, I'm going to go into settings here, um, now as you can see, right now I'm connected to my home setting. Let's see, where is, there we go, Fox 5. Let me zoom in on that. Fox 555, open. So I'm going to switch to that. OK, 
connect so that you can see that I'm connecting to FoxFi through so I'm connected I'm now connected to FoxFi so let's uh, go to browser just so you can so you can see that it works let's go to Android police um, and this of course this notebook doesn't have any 3g 4g anything it's all just it's just a wife just the Wi-Fi version the, the affordable version and it was expensive enough um, let's see of course I had to pick a, web, a website that doesn't always work great there we go yeah I don't know why it Android Police has this, I don't know, what do you call it, uh, uh, mobile version of their websites that I don't like. I don't like the way they do. So, let's go to Fandroid. There you go. You can see how fast it's loading up. Now, this is all through my phone. I mean, it's hooked up to my phone through Wi-Fi, and it's through my phone's 4G network. So, uh, let's go to... So, you can see... It is fast. At first, when the Android police might have made you think that it was slow. I didn't want you to think that, because that's not the case. That just has to do with the way their website works for some reason. Um, let's go to another website. Uh, do I have something that's not Fandroid? Tech Drive-In. Three best launchers for Android 4.0 iOS. So you can see loads up really fast and this is all connected to my phone's 4G through FoxFi. So uh, there really isn't a whole heck of a lot else to show you um, because it works and if it works, it works, right? Um, I can go back to home just to give you one more example. I'll use a different browser. Let's see, let's use Chrome. And you can see, loads up fairly fast. Um, go to one more website. I go to antitags.com. Hey, I'm always talking about antitags.com, so might as well go to their website. It's apparently going to give us the mobile version, which is really more for a Home than a tablet, so let's go to the full website. And there you go. You can see everything loads up pretty fast. It's a, uh, yeah, so this FoxFi is, you know, especially with 4G, it's about as fast as your Wi Fi connection through, uh, through your home Wi Fi. So, uh, if you have, uh, again, it's, there's no use for this if you already have a, uh, you know, if you have free tethering automatically through your provider, then there's no point for this. But if you don't have free tethering and you want to be able to tether your phone to your tablet or your uh, laptop uh, when you want to, when you need to, then uh, this will allow you to do it. So that was the app FoxFi. Um, as you can see, it's uh, not a whole lot of settings or things you need to do to it. It just works. And what more could you ask for than an app that is simple and does exactly what you want it to do and does it great. Um, so anyway, uh, as always, if you like this review, please click the like button. If you want to be updated for more reviews and subscribe to my channel. Um, if you want to share this information with your friends, then... Uh, you know, you can do so through Facebook or Twitter. I think there are buttons down there somewhere where you can share this video on your Facebook page or to Twitter or something. So feel free to do that as well. Uh, just a reminder, this review is sponsored by Andy Tags, andytags.com. So you can jump over there to check out their NFC tags and stickers. And uh, that's about it. Until next time, um, as you can see, I am uh, representing or celebrating the beginning of college football which uh, actually kicks off today. And uh, that is my favorite sport in the world, college football, love it. So if you're a college football fan and you wanna talk uh, college football, feel free to drop a line about that. 
uh, I think you can figure out what team is my team. If not, then you probably don't care anyway. Anyway, until next time, this is Eric reminding you as always that your Android phone is only going to be as good as you make it.